Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today with my monthly Aldi haul. I spent $106 and some change, so I will jump right in. I'll start right back here with produce. I got a three pack of um, mixed bell peppers, some just to have them. I just like to have them on hand to throw into different meals. Same thing with the organic broccoli. Um, I saw these nectarines. I think they were $3.99 um, and they look pretty good to me. They're really hard. I really like um, like really hard nectarines and plums and peaches. Howard likes them soft, so he probably won't eat them right now. Um, I also grabbed some um, um, grape tomatoes, lost my train of thought. I have a recipe and I needed some, so I just grabbed them. I grabbed some Fuji apples. Um, Howard really likes Fuji apples. I prefer uh, Granny Smith tart apples. I grabbed some baby gold potatoes just for recipes, just to have them on hand. And same thing with green onions. I always have green onions in my fridge. I grabbed some of these jalapeno um, peppers because I plan on making some like jalapeno poppers or grilling them something, I don't know. Uh, when I went home to Oklahoma for Memorial Day, my mom made some and so I think I'm gonna play around with the recipe a little bit. I grabbed some Italian parsley because I like the, I like Italian parsley. I like how it tastes. I like cooking with it. A lot of recipes that call for cilantro, I'll use parsley instead because my husband doesn't really care for cilantro. So I always keep parsley. Grab some garden salad uh, mix just to have for lunches or for dinner. I'm not a huge fan of iceberg lettuce, but it lasts a lot longer than spring mixes and things like that. I also grabbed a cucumber. I hardly ever buy these because I'm not a big cucumber fan, but I'm trying to eat a little bit better. And I figured if I added some vinaigrette or something to this, I could have this as a little um, snack or side. Grab some avocados um, for my husband. He likes them. He pretty much has them with every single meal. And then I also grabbed some of uh, my favorite extra fine green beans. So the package is a lot smaller. It's 16 ounces, but it still cost, actually it's even more than it used to cost when the bag was larger. But I really like the green beans, so I grabbed them. Right back here, just grab some whipped topping. Um, I have several different pie recipes. Um, I'm not sure which pie I'm gonna make first, but I needed some whip, whipped topping. Did I need this? No, I didn't, but it sounded really good. Churro whipped dairy topping. So many things you can do with this. Ice cream, hot chocolate, you name it, but it sounded delish. Um, grab some basmati white rice. Um, they had basmati brown rice too. Uh, I typically cook with jasmine, but I also like basmati as well. Um, in the vein of trying to eat a little healthier, grab some tilapia. Um, no one in my family is a big fan of fish, but I bought it, so I'm gonna make it, try to make healthier meals. I saw this and it looked really good. Just for a quick snack um, or for lunch or something like that, add some crackers to it. You get the hot salami and the, uh, oh, I didn't realize it was hot provolone. Hot salami and hot provolone. Didn't need any spices, but I grabbed this anyway. This is like one of those, um, it has four different seasonings in here. So they have a Korean one and it has the soy sesame, the bulgogi, the spicy barbecue, and the honey garlic teriyaki. Sounded really good to add to some meat or I don't know, veggies. And then they also have this Thai one, lemongrass seasoning, um, coconut lime red curry, sweet basil curry, and sesame garlic, and I think these were like $4.99 each. I grabbed this pasta simply because I've never seen it before and I, I don't know how it's going to cook up. I think it's chitara, but I like pasta, so grabbed it just to give it a try. Um, right back here, grabbed some juice for my toddler. Um, these organic juice pouches are 
um, a seasonal item. So I grabbed fruit punch and cherry. And then I also grabbed him um, an organic apple juice as well. Now, typically I buy my fried rice from Trader Joe's. I don't think I've ever had Aldi fried rice. If I have, I don't remember, but I'm not a big fan of those, that edamame in there. So usually if fried rice has edamame or green peas, I take them out and that's what I'll be doing here. But I got the chicken fried rice and the chicken lo mein. Um, if, I think I, I know I've had this before, but it's probably been years ago. So I got that. Got some white cheddar puffs for my son and I to try. I don't think my husband would, would be into that. Um, I got two of these chocolate bars. I went to Aldi after I worked out and was kind of hungry, so I was just grabbing stuff. This is caramel brownie cream, and this is crunchy peanut butter, and just sounded good. Um, also grabbed this vanilla milk chocolate almond ice cream bars. I don't think it's haagen -Dazs, um like but wanted to give it a try. And um, grab these two pies. There's this um, fast food chicken restaurant, Chicken Express, that I really like, and they have fried pies. And so I've never bought these pies before from Aldi, but I bought them. Got apple for my husband, cherry for me. I'm gonna put mine in the air fryer and see how it works out. I grabbed this uh, three cheese tortellini. This is just something I typically always buy when I go to Aldi for quick meals. Parchment paper, almost out, and I've never seen it at Aldi before. Grabbed a loaf of white bread just for sandwiches, grilled cheese, things like that. Grabbed some ricotta cheese because there's a recipe that I wanna try, and every time I think about making it, I realize I don't have the ricotta cheese, so I just grabbed it. Grabbed some heavy whipping cream, some milk for my son. Grabbed my husband this lemonade. He really likes it a lot. And that is it. That is everything that I grabbed on this quick Aldi haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.